that the second arrow, Herr Gessler, would have been for you. I missed. <laughs> if my son had been harmed in the slightest. Gessler was so infuriated that he immediately sentenced William Tell to the dungeons, had him bound and put on a boat for Gessler's castle. Along with Tell's crossbow, which Gessler intended to keep as a trophy. However, while the boat was still on Lake Lucerne, a storm arose. Gessler's men were so terrified, they untied William Tell, who knew the lake, and begged him to guide the boat to safety. William Tell did so, but as the boat neared shore, he dove over the side and vanished into the woods. Gessler was infuriated and made for his castle. But in his anger and haste, he didn't notice that there was something missing from the boat, William Tell's crossbow, which he had taken with him when he escaped. While Gessler was making his way back to his castle, William Tell's second arrow found its mark. William Tell's act of defiance inspired a Swiss rebellion that ultimately led to the overthrow their Austrian oppressors. And now, the secret of William Tell. There is no evidence that there ever was a person named William Tell. Or that the story of William Tell is anything but a folk tale. However, the story of William Tell inspired the Swiss to build a republic that has been free, democratic, and at peace for hundreds of years. Even inspired America's founders who admired the Swiss and their tradition of liberty and self-reliance. What does this say about us? Think of the stories that we love, that stand the test of time, that inspire us. William Tell. Robin Hood, Luke Skywalker, The Lone Ranger. These are all stories about freedom and about the struggle against oppression. The story of William Tell and its message of freedom says more about people and their desire for freedom in any time and place than it does about whether or not William Tell actually existed. Mr. Tell's